welcome to yet another interesting interview, I hope. I'm talking to Joan Grotis. Correct. Uh, she is, let me see if I got that right, Senior Director, Interconnect Technology for Maltec. Correct. Uh, yes. The show, very successful. Uh, the Electronica is the most important show in Europe, uh, if not in the world. Uh, what makes this so special for you? The, the nice thing for us is that we started the Interconnect Technology Center for Maltec about 18 months ago. Yes. Um, and, and what that's done is allowed us to work with our customers to really see what they wanted to do in their next generation and generation ahead for yes. printed circuits. And so what we've done is we've now seen some of the things that we've been working on coming that you're at the show and people are now asking you where are you at with the next one where are you at with the next one and so we see the excitement of having this type of technology center and so for us it's just for me it's been very fun because you now see the customers that are using your technology you've been developing we're not at Multex booth at the moment but you brought us some nice little exhibits sure. you know along the way so let yeah, let's look at them and you tell us a little bit more about them. So one of the things that's been, we work in a broad area of markets and I thought because I've traveled all the way over from California, uh, I can't carry big things so yes. I would carry small things. And so some of the things that we do is things in the wearable space. And so, you know, you're very familiar, people see kind of what's on the outside, yes. but we do things that are on the inside. And so what we do on the inside make sure that what you see on the outside will function. Yes. And so for us, it's very important for things like on the body yes. and also on the skin. Yeah. And one of the things, I'm sorry, I'm taking up the things, but one of the things on the skin that's really key, and I'm going to show you, um, just real simple, is that having something like this, you can basically activate, you can activate what's going to go on in your phone. And if you think about using this technology now, not just on your phone, but if you were to go to a supermarket and you had, instead of a prepaid card, you had a, an account, you could just put your hand against there or your arm against there, and you can get all the information and it downloads to you and you just paid. You don't have to carry all these extra things. So when will we get that? It's very easy. This this Lovely. technology right now is in the market. Okay. Uh, it's in the market on phones. Mm -hmm. um, it is. It's a near field solution, mm -hmm. and so it's going into a lot of new products. I can't talk about. Yeah. <laughs> but let me tell you, it's a very nice uh, complement for on skin and on body type of yes. wearable technology. So, and good luck with that. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much. Yes. Um, most of our readers are also interested in market developments, trends, and everything. And as we uh, as we mentioned uh, in in our discussion already, you have a technology center in California in Milpitas and one in China right. in Sushu. Uh, Zhuhai. Zhuhai. Yes, right outside of Hong Kong. Ah, okay. And um, what is actually in store for us to see from your side for 2015? What do you expect as trends, investments? Where is it going? So. You know, we talk about, we hear people talk about the Internet of Things or the Internet of yes. everything. Um, because Maltech has to deal not with only what's connecting things, we have things that we do in the background um, mm -hmm. with our customers that provide base stations, modems, yes. switches. And so for us, it's being able to keep up and allow them to have technology that they can use so when you go to the Internet of Everything, that when you use your phone or you use your device or you use your connected home, it works right away. If it doesn't, people get upset about that. Yes. So we have to do these kind of things to, in order to get in front of what our customers are going to need. And so what we've been doing is that we have a global engineering network. So we have our centers for the next generation and generation plus technologies, but we also have a global engineering network, um, which Maltech has several engineers in the field that go and work with our customers and some of the new potential customers to understand what's needed. And they feed that information back to us in California in Malpitas as well as our center in Juha. So will there be another one in the future, near or further away? I will, I will in say Europe? there will, there will well, I can say that 
It could potentially happen, but I don't know when that will be. But okay. we are making significant investment in technology and ensuring that we're putting it in the right locations specifically for our customers. Yes. And so I think with the trends that we see in the market, the things that are going on globally, um, you know, high volume is still being done in Asia, but a lot of technology ideas are, are coming out of Europe, are coming out of the U.S., and are coming out of Asia. So we'll strategically position where we're going to do the next Good. Then I'm looking forward to that information. Thank but you. for now, thank you very much for your yeah. time. It was very interesting talking to you, and we're going to see soon and talk about a little bit more about the technology. And you too. Thanks for the opportunity.